we'll guide you through how to transfer photos from your Mac to your Android. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. To go and do this, we're gonna use something called Google Drive. Google Drive is a file sharing and host platform. So go and open up a web browser, I'll use Safari. And what you wanna do is go and search for Drive or just Google Drive to be more precise. And then here we are. Now go and click and go to Drive. You will need to have a Google account to use Google Drive. Ideally use the same Google account as you use on your Android as well. But you can always use a different one and then add it to your Android. Now come over to the left and click on My Drive and you wanna click on you in the top left and click on new folder. And I'm just gonna go and name this Mac Photos like so and hit create. Now we wanna go into the folder and you wanna to head to the top left and click on new and click on file upload. Now go and find the photos. Mine are on my desktop, so I'll highlight them and go and click on upload like so and we can go and wait. After they finish uploading, come onto your Android phone and you need to go and open up Drive. If you don't already have it, get it from the Play Store. I do though in this folder. So I'll go and open it up and you need to make sure you're using the same Google account as you used on your Mac. I am, but you can always go and switch or add another one by clicking on your profile icon in the top right. Come to files, I'll quickly go and refresh this here and you should go and see the folder you created. You can click on it and then here are the images. And then what you can do is you can go and select one of them by holding your finger down. You can select them all by pressing on this icon in the top right. Then click on the three dots and you can go and click on download like so. Once they finish, you'll go and get this pop-up and we can then open our gallery. And then here are the images at the top here. It's that simple. If you found this guide useful, then please leave a like.